Ow. Hey, it's Econuntrum, and everyone has been sending me the story about 100,000 chickens killed in a fire, but that's not the real story. Check this out. Just check out a few of these headlines. 18 processing plants have burned down in the last several months. The avian flu outbreaks in the U.S. tops the previous record of 22.8 million birds wiped out. 120 pounds of ground beef recalled from E. coli. But here's the gag. This post, I posted this April 29th last year. And this was around the time when people were accusing me of fear-mongering. And I even gave you guys a heads up. Like, listen, while we're focusing on this Ukraine issue, we have to understand how this is going to affect our food supply and lead to shortages. So I was trying to warn you. And I even asked you guys, hey, just try to stockpile a little bit at a time if you can and prepare. And then, of course, as always, I provided proof. I showed you the locations of these factories that have been accidentally burnt down. And I provided what little coverage I could of the very limited media exposure about these mysterious fires taking place in these factories. And listen, I understand this news is hard to take. My goal has never been to panic anyone. It has been to show you that this is not pure speculation in hopes that you'll take it seriously and you'll get prepared. So if you're wondering what's coming next, it's definitely going to be the beef industry. It has literally been rocked to the core and devastated. And we're going to now see the effects of that this year. Listen to this. I understand people being concerned about the gas prices, but what you really need to be concerned about is what your food pricing is about to jump to, okay? Calves and babies are just now being born. Keep that in mind. So the cost to raise them hasn't hit yet. This bale of hay last year was four bucks. Bag of grain last year was six bucks. This trunk full in here last year would have cost me $14. Today, $20 for a bale of hay, $18. For a bag of grain, I got two bales in here. It's fifty-eight dollars worth of food. Last just my chick, just my goats and my horses. Two days. That's it. Wait until the the prices catch up with your slaughter market when we start rendering animals in the fall. Prepare for seventeen dollar a pound chicken, twenty five dollar a pound bacon, thirty forty dollar a pound beef. It is coming. It's not a joke. Please be cautious. Please prepare. That warning was from last year, and now we see the food inflation rise from December 2022 versus December 2021. And because so many cows were prematurely slaughtered last year for their beef, notice how things like butter, cheese, and milk have risen exponentially. So the items on this list are things that you're definitely going to take advantage of if you catch them on sale. Now... The items on this list, they have not been impacted as severely yet. So these are things that it would be really wise to buy now and stock up on. Freeze them or definitely if they're dry goods, store them. Now, for those of you who will be tempted to come here and make this post about what people eat, whether they should be vegan or whatever that is, please keep that to yourself. That is not what this post is about. I'm not here to judge what people eat and how they eat. People are struggling to eat. Huge indicator, the Zip app has reported a 95% rise in the purchase of groceries through their Buy Now, Pay Later app. One of the areas that's been hit the hardest is food. If you've never listened to me before, listen to me now. You need another income, and I've been trying to provide solutions. Everything from how to start your freelance business, starting your own coaching business, the new online biz blueprint, the creator economy, which is perfect for creatives. If you're looking to launch your own course, maybe even start a podcast, or if you are already an innovator and an entrepreneur, you can get the entrepreneur distribution pack, and then how to launch your product. Plus, there's over 50 more courses just like this. And if you're looking to advance and make your life easier, I even have the 20 video chat GPT tutorial that will show you everything from creating your chat GPT account and then how to use it to market your business. So I've been providing these solutions regardless of what people have thought about me. I've tried to help you the best that I can. It is going to be up to you because inevitably these this is here. You guys see it and you guys feel it, but it is high time you do something about it. You go to shop at conundrum.com and take advantage of it.